Well, top of the day, greetings to you, all of God's beautiful, beautiful people around the world. I greet you in the matchless name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus. Um, listen, I just want to come, um, inspire God's people to win in every um, area of their life. Listen, uh, as soon as I opened up my eyes this morning, I woke up. First thing God told me to do is go get some um, oatmeal. So, yep, 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 God, I'm going to get up today. I'm going to get some more um, oatmeal. You know, Dr. God, I mean, he has our best interest at heart. Do you hear me? He wants me to add those uh, complex carbohydrates back into uh, my meals. Now, you don't need a lot of oatmeal, but, you know, um, a little will do the body good. So, you know, I'll, whenever I eat oatmeal, I add, you know, fruits, nuts, cranberries, raisins, cinnamon. You know, I like to uh, enjoy my oatmeal. So I'm going to submit uh, to the will of my Father in Heaven and go give me some oatmeal. Okay. And so I just wanted to make sure um, I encourage you to listen to God when He is talking to you each and every, every single day. So when i woke up i uh spent time in prayer before my father in heaven prayed over my babies my grown babies they still my baby i don't care if they are uh, uh 79 they still my babies right prayed over my babies and prayed over my grandchildren my seed you know my great grand I have a great yes i have a great grandchild y'all what a blessing what a blessing to see that uh, next generation it's a blessing from god um so i did all of my praying pray for myself pray for my neighborhoods pray for uh, my co-workers pray for you know my subscribers pray for the world you know i do all that every day every day praying for people right and then um got on my uh treadmill and worked out on my treadmill and then came downstairs, worked out with my hand weights, okay? And then I went outside um, and uh, rode my bike. Got some fresh air in my lungs, you know what I'm saying? So um, that's about how my day started uh, this morning. And also, too, when I was working out with my hand weights, I had my praise music on. I was in there praising my God, okay? Because you got to keep your praise going every day. You should not miss one day praising your God, okay? And then, you know, after I get finished with this um, uh, video, you know, encouraging God's people, uh, I am going to finish my uh, smoothie. Um, I had a little bit of smoothie uh, this morning before I got on my bike. And I'm going to finish up my smoothie. And then I am going to um, get myself together and get my hips on um, uh, on my work computer and um, do some work. Now, I know later today, because Sunday uh, Federal Express was closed, I have an order to ship out today on Monday to Federal Ex Express. Um, all of those, all of my customers who um, sent me um, orders for your hair growth oil, check your um, email because I sent you a tracking number. Thank you for all of my customers that continuously uh, support the hair growth journey, okay? Because we're going to have hair all the way down to the ground, okay? Um, you know, and I just encourage everybody to be the best version of, of yourself. Be the best version um, of yourself. Spiritually and naturally. Be the best version, you know? Represent God to the utmost, okay? And, um, you know, represent God in excellence, okay? So this is uh, Prophetess Nurse Lois coming to you from the Lois Banks Ministry, encouraging God's people everywhere 
to, you know, engage in life, care about yourself. Nobody's going to care about you the way that God cares about you and the way that you care about yourself. Now, if you happen to have someone in your life who loves you and cares about you, that is such a blessing. That is a blessing, okay? But you got to care about yourself. You have to love yourself and you want the best for yourself and take, you know, excellent care um, of yourself. So this is uh, Prophetess Nurse Lois uh, coming to you from Lois Banks Ministry and just encouraging you everywhere. You know, listen, we're on the winning team. We have the Heavenly Father with us and um, uh, the fight is fixed. Any kind of spiritual battles you find yourself in, listen, the fight is fixed, y'all. I have videos uploaded, handing everybody tools on how to navigate through uh, spiritual attacks and how to stay in the fruit of the spirit, how to fast and pray, how to connect to God's word, how to speak God's word, and how to always win. Okay, so listen, ain't nobody mad but the devil. Ain't nobody mad but the devil. And don't forget how I taught you how to pray when you wake up. Father, in the name of Jesus, I bind up principalities, powers, mights, and dominions. Father, I bind up spiritual wickedness in high places off of me, off my children, off my grandchildren, off my great grand uh, daughter, um, you know, out of the workplace, out of my neighborhood, off my ministry, off my subscribers. You see what I'm saying? You got to get up purposely every day and take authority and dominion in the realm of the spirit through the power of the Holy Ghost in your mouth. Open wide, speaking to the kingdom of darkness every day. You got to do it every day. If you don't open up your mouth and speak, Satan is going to be a bully and he is going to try to take over your life and cause all kinds of calamity. Okay, so you got to like stop him with your mouth. Okay. You stop Satan with the words coming out of your mouth. Bind him. The word of God says that in the New Testament, whatever you bind in heaven is bound in earth. Bind that devil. You hear me? Bind them principalities. Every day you got to do it. Every day. You can't let one day go by without opening up your mouth and speaking directly to the kingdom of God darkness this is prophetess nurse lois coming to you from the lois banks ministry god bless you